right. Last one, real quick. If I had um, a graph. Sorry, I forgot to even write the graph. And I said find, and I wanted you to find what exactly is the equation for this graph. Well, first of all, we need to say what is our equation. And we're going to go, well, it's going to be in the form of y equals mx plus b. And we need to have memorized the components of this equation, which is this is going to be your slope, and this is your y-intercept. Then the next thing we need to do is we need to determine well, what's the y-intercept. And, re and we remembered when we talked about, we brainstormed about what is the y-intercept, we know that the y-intercept of a graph is where it crosses the y-axis. So I look up here and I say, this crosses at 0, 2. But I'm not going to put a point in for b. I'm going to put in what does actually y equal. And y actually equals 2. And then for the slope, to find the slope of a graph, what we worked at was we looked at finding using a slope triangle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a triangle between the two points. And then from that triangle, I'm going to find what is the change in the y values compared to the change in the x. What is my change in my height compared to my change in my um, distance across? So I can say, well, from the left to the right, I'm going down 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And I'm going over positive 2. So the change in the height is negative 6 over 2. Comes to negative 3. So therefore, now, if I want to write the equation, I have slope is going to be negative 3, and y intercept is going to be 2. So my equation would be y equals a negative 3x plus 2. And that is how you write an equation from a graph. <laughs>